Hi guys, welcome back to another D Disneyland Railroad Simulator video. In this video, I'm going to explain how a steam, a steam engine op operates and what every single control in here does. So, as you can see, we're As you can see, we're about 55 pounds. Okay, first I'm going to open the steam valve for the hydrostatic, hydrostatic lubricator. And this is the return to return the steam back to the air compressor. Okay. Alright. Let me scoot in here. Okay. This valve turns on the oil. To turns on the oil. So let me turn on turn that on. Okay. Then this is the blower sh shut off. I'm gonna open that. This here is the animizer sh uh, animizer shut off. I'm gonna open that as well. And this is the header valve, which makes um, makes the in injectors, animizer, blower. The air compressor will work. So I'm gonna open that. Open it. Open it all the way. <coughs> God, I have it. Okay. I'm gonna open the fire box. Okay, this is my side glass right here. This is the water water supply valve. I'm gonna open that. Now you can see the water level is in the side glass. This here is the return valve, which makes the water level appear at its own at its uh, at its appropriate water level. I'm going to open that. Okay, we start. We start the fire. Let me turn on the blower. Light fire box. Close the fire box door. And lock it and then open the seal all right now we got fire going in there Oil, 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 
from the tender here, it goes from underneath it, the the locum holder, and it and there's a nozzle inside the fire fire box, and when I if I open it. If I open it all the way, this seal controls how much how much oil is going into the fire fire box. Okay, and. This valve right here is the blower. It, it sends it 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 creates a draft of the fire to make a hot to make a harder fire. It shoots it it creates a draft going up to the smokes going up to the smokes back, creating a a better fire, harder fire. It helps. The only time you use the blower, well, I use it all the time. But the only time you need to really use it is during heating, heating, and cooling down processes. Okay. This is if the animators are on. If the animators, if the animators are not on, you see it's smoking. We don't want that. So what the animator does, it breaks up the fuel strings, breaks it up into particles to make a clean fire. And yeah. Side and one on the engineer side. I'm going to turn on the lower on the way. Ten, ten of two.
react to it was okay. What I just did is put sand into the fire box. The only time you need to do this if you is is the only time you need to send the flues is if you notice the engine isn't heating well. There could be soot inside the flues. So what the what I just did? I'll do it again to give you an example. What you need to do for the spread to put sand in the food is you're gonna turn on the blower on high. Turn on the blower on high and just click sand flues. Put that in sand in the far box. And when it, when it's done, turn down the blower to the setting where you had it. And then I like to go down here. Put the elevator back where it was set at. Okay. Put click light fire. Close up. So close the fire box. Then open the open the seal, and once you've done that, it should fire properly now. Operating pressure is one fifty. 150 to 155, so I'm gonna do wait until the pressure gets up to there. This here is the blow down shut off. Okay, these two, these two valves right here are that try try. Which has been the olden days. Now I said I sound really old when I say that. I know I know that. But in the olden days there used to not there there wasn't a sunglass. So how the engineers um, so how the engineers used to trick the trick the water level is they used to Open it up. Open it up. Open the top one first, and you get steam. The top one is the driest. and the bottom one when you should get water. What should we do? So that's how they used to take the water without the water bottle water glass. This here is the air compressor start off. This is the air compressor sh shut off. Okay, now I'm going. Now I'm going. I'm going to, now what I'm doing is I have the exhaust <coughs> exhaust 
gas drain, drain and the supply drain open. So, I'm going to open up the, this valve slowly. Now you got, now you see the steam coming out from the air compressor right here. You see the steam coming up from here. Water to the engine. So how, you, so how I do that is open the water to the water supply valve, which is for this one right here. Now, when you open the valve, it takes water from the the tender, and it gets to this point right here, but it can't get into it because the the water is under internal pressure. So, so you guys turn on the seam to inject it. I usually keep the water level between two to two and a half, two and a half minutes, but really, really, you gotta keep it under under a nut and a half. Okay. What the, this is called the John John Johnson. Bar, which is, which is another one for the, the reverser, and what the reverser does, it it's like a transmission in, in your car. When it's so when it's 44, it's like you're driving in first gear. Well, as you get going, every every you have you been going for a while, you don't need all that energy. So. Hook up the Johnson, Johnson R. So I'll tell you when it when it gets going. Below the whistle. This is the throttle. The throttle. It's the gas. It's 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 just like a gas pedal on your. It's just like a gas pedal that you use to go in the car. It's just like a gas pedal, gas pedal like in a car. But okay, you down. So. So, 
So this is our steam dome right here. So what the the throttle what, what so what the throttle does it it is it opens the valve inside the steam dome that that allows steam go through the dry pipe into a wide pipe into a, the, what the throttle does it 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 is is it allows steam to go to go down into the fire fire box somewhere into a dry pipe and down into a white into a white pipe down into the steam cylinder. So that's how the wheels turn. So as as I was saying, the drum. The, the more you open it, the faster, the faster you grow. That the faster you will grow. Go. The more you open it, the the more you open it, the faster you grow. So what the Justin bar does is, when you, as you've been going for a while. You don't need all that entity, so simple thing. You you pull back on the instruction bar. It it's it's a, it saves it saves steam that way, so you're not wasting steam. And it also makes it go faster. This here, this here, is the 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 brick stand. So when you open it, it it's a long air in the brick the brake lines and the air that's inside the brake lines stop the stop the stop the train. Okay, this is the fast release. You can also release the air using So we release the air using this devil right here, but it re releases slow slower. So so you can e use either one. All right. This here is the c c cylinder. Cylinder drain. So when we're stopped, and if the cylinder drains are not open, then water will, the steam will condense into water. So when we get watered, it will damage the engine. So 
we don't want that. So you always, always should leave the cylinder drain open when we're stopped. Which we don't do. And you can see steam when the cylinder drains are open. Now I'm going to close it. Wait for a while. Now you don't see steam coming out. That's why. That's why you don't see it because I I closed the cylinder drain. Then I op I open it. Then I close it. Okay. Open the throttle to about half. You can turn down the fuel. Turn that down just a little bit. Turn on, turn on the water and the injectors.
turn that down. the fire looks right here we can't leave we cannot leave we cannot leave the firebox door open for long because it will shock the fire and we don't want that Now we can get 
whistle, the whistle signals are very basic. One whistle means to stop. Two whistles mean two whistles mean the uh, two whistles means to go forward. Three whistles mean go backwards, and four whistles mean we need to talk to the conductor about some about some. Uh, about some music. And when we come to a crossing, we do a short, a long, long, a long, long, short, long, like this. Emergency, emergency. Well, guys, this is going to do it for our today, tonight's video. 
Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash up, smash. Well guys, this is going to do it for our video tonight, hope you guys enjoyed, if you did, smash, up, smash, up, smash that subscribe button, click that notification bell to all, so you never miss out, it, don't, it helps me out a lot, leave a comment and I'll see you in the next one, peace out.